Hi, today I'm filming a crafty haul. These are just some things I got uh, today because um, Santa uh, gave me some money for um, beautiful papers and a local shop here in Ljubljana, it's actually this one, Ryer was having a sale 30% uh, off of all Christmas and winter stuff and then I had some coupons uh, let's just go through it so the first thing I got was a border punch um, I, I only had one of these before and I gave it away in my in my uh, declutter uh, phase um, but um, I thought I'd try it again uh, with a different um, a different pattern this time I just saw a few journals with punched uh, pages and thought it would be so cute to try it wasn't that bad, it was 8.5 euros and I got I think 15% off so and it, you know, it lasts a while and if I ever get bored with it, I can just give it to a friend who works in a kindergarten. She she gets all my um, supplies when I'm through with them and she makes beautiful things with them. She's happy to have them and I move on to new stuff. Okay, so the second thing I bought was this Prima Marketing uh, cling stamps. Uh, I'm not really much for background patterns, but I find when um, I uh, try to distress m my papers or, uh, you know, just to make the whole thing more cohesive and more interesting, not just a plain background, I thought this would be a good thing to have. Um, <clears throat> I've seen people use them curved, so you just get a little a little smidgen of the pattern on the sides of your paper and I thought I'd try it. This thing was $9.99 and let's see so $9.99 and I got 20% off of that so not too bad. Uh, then I got two packs of Scrap Berries uh, winter themed paper which meant they were 30% off even without the coupon. Um, in Ljubljana we only have, I mentioned this before, we, we have I think three craft stores. Uh, Ryer is the biggest and the, the best. I spend half my paycheck there every month. Um, well never mind. Uh, but um, coupons are, are not really prevalent. We don't have anything like the Michael sales and 60% off coupons that Americans have and I envy them for. Um, so yeah, but this was 30% off which was great of course. Um, the original price is 12.52, so a third off is very fine. Um, I just cut off, I'll just remove that, I cut off the part up you know on, on the top so I could pull it out quicker and show you so okay here it is I love the the color scheme it's not traditional um, Christmas but it's still winter themed still looks like snow I love this pattern it's gonna make a beautiful album I think and you know, a few years back, like 10 years or so, when I first saw the pink and mint green and turquoise Christmas instead of the red, green and gold, I was smitten. Um, and um, yeah, now they're going even more into pastels and I of course love it. So, a few polar bears and a polar fox. I don't know. Maybe next year for um or this year at the end of the year for um December daily it would be great.
I don't know what these birds are called, but they're super cute. And here a cut apart page. And so you get two of each design. That was Winter Wonderland. And another one I got also from Scrap Berries was The Taste of Winter. This one is um, also more pastel and cool tone, not traditional colors, lots of light blue and uh, some, some beige. Okay, so blue on the other side, I love this thing. Some deer, apparently all males, but there you go. Some poinsettia. Is that how you pronounce it? I, I never know. A little bunny. And I love these. Um, well, we call them Sinichka. I don't, I don't know what they're called in English, but yeah, it's adorable. I love how um, you get two of each design because they're double-sided, and well, I would have a problem choosing between some of the patterns. And here's the cut apart. Uh, I prefer this cut apart to the other package because there's less fussy cutting you just cut out the squares and use them as tags even as gift tags but you know journaling tags okay so that was the other side and um, the ne next thing I got this was basically uh, the reason I went in there and I chopped online it was botanical notes I've been eyeing this paper forever but um, couldn't really bring myself to buy it it was I think 21 euros but I got 20% off of that and the papers are just gorgeous and you get a lot of them so 48 sheets I just cut off the um, sticker so we can look at it quicker without the fussing uh, gold foiling you know so trendy right now um, three sheets of each design more gold foiling I mean I love gold foiling gold was a quiet taste for me I'm, I'm a 90s child so you know the grunge everything was silver god forbid anyone wore gold um, but I prefer it, you know, as little accents on, on pages, not all the way through, but this is the paper I enjoy the most. Um, it's linen. It has a linen feel and it's gorgeous. I don't know if one can see, but yeah. And it's sage green. Oh. Anyway, um some um, some shimmer papers so these are all butterflies shimmer papers I love I love the pastels of course and the dots even though they're not polka dots but dots more vintage uh, floral designs also on pearlescent paper Ugh. And yeah, this looks uh, another canvas uh, type paper, and this looks like pages from an old botanical encyclopedia. It's gorgeous. I wonder how it will bend, because I usually bend papers for my uh, albums. We'll see, I hope it doesn't crack in the middle. So more sage green with little tiny florals and polka dots on the other side. I love the distressing on the edges. Some cute birds and uh, musical notes on the other side. And um, this, this 
pattern keeps appearing in different um, collections. You know, the, the diagonal stripes in cream and pink. And I love it because I use it to write on the diagonal. Um, I made a page like this in my um, scrap journal this year. Junk journal. It looks adorable, so I'm looking forward to using these. Lots on the other side, the same ones that were in blue. And then some cute butterflies, more diagonal stripes. I love these. And yeah, I think I saw uh, Tiffy Butter make a uh, Midori insert with these. I love it. Notes and hints. So cute. And some pale blue with... Uh, I, I love it when the paper is mainly plain. Um, I mean, lots of lots of free space and then just some embellishments on the side. I love this side also. I love when they coordinate like this. Okay, some mustard. I think we had this one in gold foil in the beginning. Let's see. Yeah, so this one was pink uh, with gold foil and here it's beige with mustard. Some chevron on the other side. And then a lovely muted rose pink with another chevron on the back. Okay. So that was it. Now just one more paper pad. And this one is um, Dove Crafts. Uh, you get 36 sheets of acid and lignin free paper. And it costs 9 euros and 20 cents. So that's a great deal. And I got it 15% off I think. Because I had a coupon. So you get three of each, cute pastels, um, muted greens, they had a lot of uh, collections, they had one for boys with dark blues, but it was sold out, uh, they had a Christmas one that I missed also, they still have um, a pink one for girls, but I thought this one would be perfect because it has some yellow, you know, for spring um, layouts and so on. Okay, this one's not my favorite, but I guess we'll use it. I love this one. I don't even know what this color is. Is it blue? Is it purple? Some sort of lavender on, on, on steroids or something. I don't know. I love it. I love this sort of pages because I saw Project Life cards on it, so it's still a little color. Uh, it's plain on the other side, so you can write, but it brings into focus the card you saw on top of it. Okay, three of those. More stripes, but I don't know, I'm, I'm not a big fan of this color combination. We'll see how I use it. A lovely purple, starburst or whatever this pattern is, um, green floral, and of course my favorite, periwink of blue with cream polka dots, oh, polka pique, <laughs> anyway, so cute. And the last page is this. This reminds me of, the, you know, like a cauliflower cut in half. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.